Okay, you can see here, I've been practicing. Um, the reason why I'm practicing is because I'm no good at this. So, I was just trying a few layers out. Uh, that was my last one I did. Not too bad. So I'm going to go ahead and try it on this. Um, hopefully I've got it centered enough. This is all, I'm just eyeballing all this stuff because, I mean, this fabric didn't cost very much to, and it's been laying around. So I'm just using old stuff I've got. Here we go. Ready? I learned that you don't hold the fabric very tight or you get squished letters. But you gotta hold it enough or you get your letters not aligned very well. So we're gonna see how this works. It seems like it's going all right right now. Let's see. Sometimes it, it makes it clinking noises. I don't know. I don't know if it's... I replaced the needle on this and busted, so I don't know did I not place it right or something, but it's still sewing, so uh, I did something all right. It's on the D right now. Hopefully it'll not crunch up on the next letters here. And O. It's got two more letters to do. G. And the exclamation point. That's the one I always worry about because it doesn't... See. See what it does. See what we did here. Oh, gee, wow. There we go. So, we're going to put this over the top of this doggy backpack thing I have. I was thinking about putting her name either above it or below it, but I got a service dog, and that's the most important thing. Um, so, there we go. We're getting there.